in America too. What's this about? It's the story about a man that's trying to find the ultimate EDC organizer and dive kit. Can't we just watch 90 Day Fiance? Ah. All right, for those that don't know, Alpha 1-9er just came out with a brand new backpack. It's right here. This is the Pathfinder backpack. I'll leave my review of it up in the corner of the screen so you could check it out after you watch this review, okay? After, this is an excellent backpack, great VX material. And speaking of VX, they came and gave you some, some, some additions. Some additions to your VX game. Alpha 1.9er came with a nice tech pouch. This is the Surge tech pouch, and this is the Ambit dive kit. We're gonna go through the tech pouch first. We're gonna walk through it. We're gonna talk about it. Like I said, VX42 right here, number eight YKK zips. I'm not gonna do the dimensions. I think what's more helpful is to put some stuff up against this thing and take a look at it, you know? So here's a knife. Uh, a knife that I think a lot of people are familiar with. This is the Spyderco Paramilitary 3, or Para 3, it's not Paramilitary 3, it's Para 3. You can see the size difference there. So this is not a small tech pouch. How about a Field Notes notebook? Same size as your Word notebook, but a little bit less. This is, this is a, a budget version of that. So if you can see the size comparison, if I hold it still, there you go. So you can see that this is a pretty large tech pouch. Um, how about the last size comparison, a regular ass pencil. <laughs> a regular ass pencil. All right, so that's the size comparison. Now let's get into this thing. Right here on the front, you got a place to fly your flags. For the guys that want to fly the flag, here you go. So you got a large area. This is like five by four. So you could put like maybe two or three uh, morale patches up there. I got my Bye Felicia from, of course, Friday. Cree. Bye Felicia. And then from another favorite of mine is the Valhalla Admittance One. That's from Mad Max, the new Mad Max Fury Road. To Valhalla! On this thing, I mean, you got mil spec webbing, double stitch all the way around on the outside. On the back here, you got a, a nice little pocket. These are number eight YKK zips. Smaller items can fit in here and it, it is a little tight for me to grab stuff out. The Leatherman squirt right there. I have so many damn leather, man. I try to, I get confused. And then I got a little big lighter right there. So smaller, smaller items can fit in this back pocket. Now, getting into the interior, you see this thing is pretty fat. It's pretty wide. It's not small at all. So look at the spine of it. Yeah, yeah, it's got some stuff in it. So double zips. So you got, you can actually zip it you know, up and down so it can go this way with it or this way with it. And I'm not gonna delay any longer. I'm gonna open it up and show you what's inside. So you got a lot of bungees, a lot of cord slots. So you have a one, two, three, four over here. And you got places where you can stick cords underneath as well. So these are some larger slots on in the underneath part. And then on the other side, you have some spots up here. I think the, these are perfect for pens. So I did put a G2 Pilot pen and a sharp, uh, a Sharpie over there. This is my Anchor Battery Candy Bar. So this is a nice size for that. So you have the same kind of concept in the back here. So you got two bands and then you have a larger band in the back, back side of it and a larger band in the back side of this. So it's four larger bands and then two, two smaller bands here and then four smaller bands up here so that's like the organization most of the organizational spots in here then in the middle what's really interesting is they put some velcro here maybe you want the 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 patch that doesn't make the front that day you can store the patch here i just put the we all float down here you know that's from they all float out here you guys know where it's coming from so on the sides right here, this is one of the things that I ran into and I was like, mm, I'm not sure about that. 
Um, you got Velcro on these sides. I would have loved to seen this a zipper, be a zipper. Because this right here, like if you have a smaller item that you do stick back there, then you're in the office and you gotta, yeah. That's not my favorite thing. I would have liked to definitely seen a zipper right there, but I have my Maxpedition micro wallet back there. And you can slip, you know, that that um, Fields Notes notebook will fit back there. And matter of fact, I, I think that's what I put on the other side is one of those Field Notes notebooks. You can see that Velcro is, it's kind of um, awkward to grab too because it's right up against the zipper line. So you gotta kind of get your thumb in there to grab it. And I do have my word notebook. That's the one I'm actually writing in. And then you have the Alpha One Niner tag in the back, which they hid really well. I love the red interior of this. It goes with Hatfinder backpack because that also comes in red interior. That's the Surge pouch. Perfect combination to go with the <laughs> with the Pathfinder. Now let's get to the Dob kit which I haven't had the opportunity to use, to be totally honest, because I'm not traveling right now because of, well, you know, you know why, guys, you know why. This, the material on this is a little bit different. This is actually VX21, so it's lighter. It's bigger, but it's lighter. So I'm gonna throw the dimensions up on the screen again, but let me do the same size representations here. This is the pair of three right up against it. So you can see that this is very this is very much larger. See how see them in, in comparison to one another. You know, this is very much larger. So this is with a guy that has a lot of hair care products. They he, he gonna bring the whole medicine cabinet. So this is that field notes notebook. You see the size comparison there? And then this is next to the pencil. Yeah. Large. Large, large, large. So, there we go. This is the Ambit kit. We still have number eight YKK zips on the outside. And this is a unique design. I kind of like to see this origami style kind of thing. You know, that, that's pretty cool. I like it, Alpha One Niner. On the back, you do have a handle. So, you know, if you're taking it to the shower, sometimes you gotta carry your stuff. Especially, I know when, when you go camping and stuff, you got to carry your stuff to the showers or if you're in the gym you know you got to carry your stuff to the shower so this is pretty cool uh, for the person that's going to this to the gym or you know has to be mobile with their stuff so you got some hypalon tabs on the end there's a you know a pocket back here where you can stick some stuff in here i don't have anything i don't have anything in there but you know you can stick some stuff in there um it's kind of a thin pocket but let's get into the main portion of this thing right it zips down double zippers and then it opens up now the the idea which i think the idea of this is for you to hang it on a door so it's got a hook up here you can hang it on the back of a door you know you've got the you know you use the hook hang it up then you have access to all your stuff so you got mesh pockets two mesh pockets now these mesh pockets aren't the regular hard use mesh that alpha one niner usually uses this is like you know this is a softer mesh it's a nicer kind of forgiving mesh so it's got a lot of give to it so in there you know i got my purell i packed it up like if i was going to travel i haven't traveled anywhere guys with this but i wanted to show you what it could all hold so you know you guys can get an idea. Some guys are back to traveling. I haven't got my vaccine yet, so I'm waiting on that. Once I get my vaccine, then I might, you know, I might start hitting them, hitting them flights up. So toothbrush holder, and this is my actually my razor I've been using. This is Harry's, man. Harry's, I thought was a gimmick. It's not. This is not a commercial for Harry's, but this razor stays sharp, and I've shaved a couple times with it, and I love it so yeah man so you can fit some flatter items in here got your alpha one niner tag right there on the side and then down here you got a pocket as well but this is like your main capacity right here so it's even got this tab kind of holds it in because if you really wanted to like pack this out it might just start to droop so you know thinking ahead alpha one niner put 
a nice little stay there. So I got a regular brush, you know, brush my hair, keep them waves, you know, I'm <laughs> regular speed stick, chick, you know, axe, hand cream. What I really want to show you, I'm going to move all the stuff out of the way. What I really want to show you is just the space in here that you guys have. So you have a lot of space. All of this stuff was fitting in that in that one pocket. So a lot of space. There is a little zipper compartment in the back here where you could stick some things. And that could be like your wet dry section. I think that's what they designed this for. So like if you have something that's possibly wet, you could stick it in there. You know, I think it's more about the, the style of this Someone that's in love with the VX material will love this. You know, they'll love the the surge and the and the ambit together as a kit. Kind of goes with you know this VX bag or another VX bag they have is some solid organizational options right here. They're the price on these the forty five dollars for both of them. If you if you're asking me, hey George, should I buy it? I think it really depends on do you want a VX organize a tech pouch because they're kind of rare like i haven't seen too many vx organizer tech pouches and i haven't seen that many vx dob kits so if you're looking for the, this material these are great options if you're looking for something that's like you want to coordinate with your backpack i get you well the secret is you got to coordinate uh-huh most people don't coordinate so you got to coordinate yes that's what you did I think it's a great option, man. <laughs> I do. I think it's a great option. Guys, I mean, that's it. Let's wrap it up, man. <laughs> Let's wrap it up. Guys, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. If you love this content, subscribe to the damn channel because it's totally damn free. And if you got a question about backpacks, flashlights, knives, anything life, <laughs> leave it down there in the comments. I'll try to get back to you. And I'll see you guys in the next one, man. What is this about again? You're talking to me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you wanna get to that? Let's do it again. What? How many times do you want me to do this? That's the story of a man that's trying to find the ultimate EDC organizer and travel dob kit. Can't we just watch 90 Day Fiance? Ah! <laughs>